Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. We are back. It is Wednesday, November 9th. It is also my birthday. Cheers. I'm officially 25. Officially in my mid towards end of my 20s. Beginning of the end of my 20s. It feels good. I picked up my coffee today. As you guys know, if you follow me on Instagram, I literally get this coffee. If not every day, every other day. It's from Real Good. I just get the homemade, well, I get the either a hot or an iced coffee. But okay, wait, I'm messing this up already. Hot latte with the homemade almond milk. Their homemade almond milk is called the Justin Bieber milk. Sometimes when I order it, I like to be irregular and I like to be like, hi, can I get a hot latte with the Justin Bieber? And they just know. Anyways, this is what I get. It's so good. It's so basic, so you'd think it would taste bland, but you guys, it is like the creamiest, oh, sweet. It's not like too sweet, but it's like sweet enough. And since it's homemade almond milk, it's literally just like almonds, water, salt and dates and i'm very like in the morning i can't have a lot of sugar so this is just perfect it like just hits the spot winter is around the corner and this year i'm going to try everything in my power to not be seasonally depressed i'm starting to like wake up earlier and go to bed earlier i listened to emma chamberlain's podcast and she said that she tries to like do something that like takes up a bunch of her time and like kind of like fixates on it so i was like okay i'm gonna fixate on like vitamins <laughs> i bought a bunch of vitamins and i've been really into taking vitamins so i'm going to show you the ones that i'm taking right now i have a lot and then i also just bought a few more from amazon i take l-glutamine this is good for your gut um, I put this in water and it doesn't taste like anything so I just drink like a glass of water in the morning So take for my gut the just calm by just thrive and this helps manage stress and it's a probiotic take a lysin this is good if you get cold sores I get cold sores mostly in the winter time due to stress and anxiety um, so this just helps support your immune system vitamin d3 you can actually okay I'm not a doctor so don't listen to me But if you do research and if you ask your doctor if you are like affected by the weather if you're seasonally depressed or anxious You can take up to like five or six of these a day. I personally take right now. I'm taking three I'm gonna gradually work into four gradually work into five. I took like four Four the other day and it like made me really jittery so I'm gonna work my way up with these so right now I'm just taking three <laughs> I bought IV guard this TMI it's just good if you have IBS vitamin b12 because our bodies don't produce b12 and it's actually really good for mood and brain function just filmed like a get ready with me video for tiktok um for this bag it's by rebecca minkoff it's so cute i'm literally obsessed with this i feel like the furry bags were very in in like 2020 but this bag i feel like it's the shape it's just so chic and i love it so i paired it with this gray oversized blazer this little white tank top these jeans and then well not jeans these are like just leather pants and then these boots which are steve madden all of this actually linked on my like to know it so i'll just link that down below for you guys but i'm seriously so obsessed with this outfit it's like adorable so now i'm gonna film another video i have to go to a fitting at like three or four o'clock i need to film a couple videos before i go and do that but what was i saying i want to do like a put an outfit together with my boyfriend's clothes because he has a couple clothes on my clothing rack right now and they're really cute so i feel like i can make a really cute outfit with them so i think i'm gonna film that for tiktok and then i'm just gonna do like two more like outfit of the day videos 
for Instagram Reels. I just went and picked up the dress. I said I had a fitting, wait, did I say I had a fitting? Technically, like, wasn't really a fitting. I just kind of, like, went and picked up a dress and a pair of heels because I have a luncheon tomorrow with Jimmy Choo and Aziza. So I'm wearing a pair of Jimmy Choo heels and then a nice pink Aziza dress. I'm going to show you guys it when I get home because I need to try it on before the event tomorrow. I also went to the real real. I wanted to record it and like film it but I'm like no because I haven't made a decision yet. I'm like looking at a Chanel bag. I don't think I'm gonna get it from the real real but they had the bag that I want and honestly like Chanel never gets this bag in anymore and it's annoying because I've been looking for it since like July. And I even went to Chanel and asked and they only had it in like the size that I don't want and then the girl was like, oh, we might get one of them in September. Like, let me give you my number. He texted me in September. It was the bag I wanted, but not the hardware that I wanted. So I'm still waiting, but they had the bag at the real real. It was like a 2021. It was never used. It still had the box, dust bag, everything. It was the right hardware but I just didn't know about the size. I think it was a little too small. So I'm gonna try the size up and see, but of course they don't have it. So the girl was like, if we do get it in, I will call you so you can just look at it. And I was like, I don't really care what color it is. I just need to see the size because then I'm gonna go to Chanel and just like say, this is exactly what I want. The second you get it in, call me. I'm coming in with the credit card. I need to make moves on this bag now. I've been staring at it for too long. Now is the time. I'll get it for myself for the new year. If it comes in time, God knows when it comes. That is the Chanel bag drama. And I think I'm gonna go home. Um, I'm gonna edit some content, send it over to my manager, and then I'm gonna get ready to go work out. That is the plan for the rest of the evening. This is the dress. It's really cute. Um, I need to try it on. And then I got these shoes, which are also so cute. So I'm gonna put on this outfit and show you guys. But I'm gonna show you my outfit now because I'm wearing my, well, I was wearing like my boyfriend's hat, but I'm also wearing my boyfriend's sweatshirt right now. This is my vest it's from PE Nation and then his essentials hoodie. And I'm wearing my good American cargo pants. I was also wearing my Jordans and then my Jacques Muse headband. But this was my outfit just to go run errands. This is the vet. I have these Jimmy Choo heels on. And then I have the Aziza dress. I just don't know if I want to do this bag or this one. This one literally matches the shoes perfectly. Let me know what you guys think. Am I making the right decision with this bag? I don't know. I feel like it works. Like it just works so much better than this. It's kind of more like, it's not really giving, but th this is giving. I'm kind of nervous. I'm like not gonna lie. I'm pretty nervous. This is the outfit in full effect. Is my brightness down? It's really dark in here. I was wearing the Aziza dress with the Jimmy Choo heels. I did these gold hoops. I think they're from Petite Moment. I have on this ring. I'll link it down below. I like really don't remember what the brand is called. And I'm carrying this bag. I literally got this bag off of Amazon, but it matches the outfit so well and then I'm gonna wear like a white long coat
home it was really cute and the setup was adorable as you guys saw i like can't even believe i was invited to that that was just like the nicest thing ever and i met so many people from the jimmy choo team i met aziza got a little gift from jimmy choo the wrapping was really cute but i already opened it and then i was like fuck i should probably vlog it but it's fine i got this um lipstick it's this beautiful like pink color like that is so fancy and the color is 006 oh my pink and i'm just kind of hanging out for the rest of the day it's already like 4 30 so i'm gonna take it easy i filmed a tiktok like right when i got home and now i'm gonna hang out jason yeah i just ran a couple errands and i brought jay a pup cup <laughs> and I brought myself coffee. This is the Louis Vuitton Starbucks cup. I worked out. I dropped off my dress. Walked around a little bit. I was like really tempted to go into Bloomingdale's because they had so much Christmas stuff, but nothing was open. And then I was like, ooh, should I go to Anthropology and go buy a bunch of candles for Christmas? And then I was like, no. And we're not going to go throw a bunch of money around at 9.30 in the morning. Jay and I are going to go on a little walk for our mental health. dinner i took a shower i washed my hair so i'm feeling really clean but i wanted to show you guys my skincare routine right now because i've been using a couple of new products first i washed my face in the shower with the dentist dr dennis gross face wash is just the cleansing gel i just used this spray this is indie lee it's technically like a toner but you just spray it on which I think is so much easier because I literally never have cotton pads and it smells so good it smells like a spa I want to start using this road peptide gel but people have been saying it makes them break out so I'm like skeptical maybe I'll just kind of lay off I'm gonna put on this um, facial oil from Elemis and I use this to um, gua sha go in with a moisturizer my dr dennis gross daily moisturizer i do like three to four pumps of this versed eye balm this is like a retinol eye balm really don't know if it like works that well but i like the feeling of this eye balm so i just got this from sephora it's the peppermint flavor i thought it was you know very on brand for the season i apply a very very generous amount of this i love it and that is it for the nighttime skincare. <laughs> 